Hey everybody, it's Overkill here with episode 2 of the Total War Three Kingdoms 8 Princess Sima Liang uh, campaign. So in the last episode, it looked kind of rough, but then we uh, managed to get uh, Bai Jin and Cao Huan as, uh, as vassals. That's awesome. So now we can take out uh, Sima Chang, Chang, whatever it is, and um, no. yeah, we could actually take over this area. And then we could give uh, Nanyang to... Uh, Cao Huan himself and make him a more powerful vassal because he does only have one settlement which is kind of bad but we did manage to save him from a war that he was in if he needed saving that is which he probably did um, but I don't think there's anything anyone else that I really care about getting non-aggression with um, no, Shan Yun is across the river so I don't really care uh, it'd be bad if Song Wei declared war How can we and we could get that pretty easily Okay, no, that's not worth. That's not worth anything. Um, yeah, I'll do that. Sixty-five, six hundred and fifty, for him to leave me alone forever. Well, until he breaks it, or just breaks it and becomes untrustworthy. Yeah, sounds good to me. For China. All right, we do have a trebuchet. It might be worth it getting rid of some archers for it. We don't even have flaming shot yet. We really need to level this guy up. Uh, let's end another turn. And then we can start besieging uh, Zhang Yang. And then we'll take it for ourselves. A nice level 5 city. Uh, man, you're such a warmonger. He's going to war with Sima Ying now, his brother. Sima, Li, uh, Sima Liang and Sima Yang. Cool. That's this guy. Nice. They like each other more. Uh, so everybody actually likes each other. I think at one point this guy didn't like me or didn't like this guy or something. So that's nice. And yeah, there's a good chance that he'll come out to actually fight. That's a huge garrison. But we could definitely beat it. So we're just going to go ahead and uh, continue the siege and hope he comes out to fight me. Uh, and if he doesn't, he's going to take attrition this turn. So uh, for his sake, he better. So yeah, that'll also that'll also put us at our um, limit again. Oh, we're actually getting a spirit per turn. That's nice. Very nice. So yeah, the more we can make everybody like us, the easier time with diplomacy we'll have. Obviously. Choose your words hmm. wisely. Nope, never. Well, you're gonna die. Sorry. Um, sorry, I'm going in and out of the uh, stuff like that a lot. Shan Yu. Clarity and truth shall guide us. Yeah, never. But he does. He feels threatened, I suppose. See the only. Oh, never mind. I was gonna say the only problem is I don't actually border him. It's just my vassal, but I do border him here, obviously. But I don't really have any intentions of going south anytime soon, really. I still have a lot of things to worry about here, and the fact that, you know, I can't expand really anyway, so... Uh, maybe we'll get non-aggression with him. That's just one less... Per so and I'll, I'll just take it to make him happy. So be it. We'll just take that so it's one less person to worry about declaring war on us out of the blue. Because that would be quite annoying. Oh, we would be no threat to you. Non-aggression with Sima Mao, which is the guy that I slaughtered. I wonder if he owns any territory now. Um, I mean, sure, and I'll take your money. May we meet again? I'm pretty sure he has no An land. But... Offer. You would agree. Uh, I mean, yeah, I'm already at war with him. Wait, what? Oh, never mind. What is this? A different seam away? Oh my God, there's two. <laughs> wow. So there's the eight princes seam away, and then there's this guy. Oh my god. Well, it'll result in his independence if I uh, don't accept, so I kind of have to, don't this has I? Been very encouraging. So where's the second Sima way? Oh my god, that's confusing. Okay, here they come. They're attacking. Uh, let's do it. Oh, we don't have flaming shots, so my um, so long as fortune shines trebuchet down, won't be super useful. We shall know glory. Indeed. Together, brother, we will unify China brother and then like always the strategist has nothing to say he's shy I suppose 
They are close oh, to mind. Be mindful. Be mindful. Oh, there's no, the city. Fish. Jesus Christ. Okay, thanks for uh, yelling at me. That scared me. So our cab are kind of messed up, so we'll save them for uh, later. If we actually come back here, we'll be on a hill, which is nice. Cool. Put the axes on the sides here. Trebs. Get everybody chilling here. Alright. So yeah, we just want them to come to us, basically. But I'll definitely take some duels. I don't think either of them wanted to, though. Yeah, this is the perfect spot. Our crossbows will be able to fire out over our lines easily. Yeah, he can't duel and this guy doesn't want to because I'm much stronger than him. Makes sense. So yeah, I won't actually be able to duel, so it's pointless to be out here. And they have a lot of archers. Holy shit, they have... Yeah, a lot. Okay, that's... Oh my god. Unlimited archers. I mean, to be fair, I guess I have a lot too, but... That's spooky. They do have a 45% range block chance, which is pretty good, and I can actually put it up with this guy's ability. I wish this guy had the uh, minus melee evasion and armor, that'd be really useful. Huh. Sima Liang has, uh, or Liang, has a 45% range block chance. It's actually quite good. We could use him to waste some ammo, maybe. All I know is these fuckers are taking forever to get here. Holy cow. Hurry up! Did anyone teach you how to march? I can't believe they're all still fresh. What the hell? They were running all this time. Everyone's perfectly fine. Yeah, if I could just disrupt... Oh, they took their time to create this nice little formation. Of course they did. Let's see if their archers will waste a few... Doesn't look like they want to. Don't want to waste no arrows on me, boys? Oh, there we go. Oh, no, that's because they're being shot at by the trebuchet, I think. Yeah, they are. Okay. Let's just disrupt their formation a little bit. Alright, get out of there, boy! Mm, they're going for a hard flank over here. Oh, whoops, don't run into him. That would be a bad time. Okay, so there's no cab on this side, so let's get ours over here. I'm gonna try to thread the needle here. Yeah, let's get some killing in on these uh, these archers, shall we? Okay, their cavalry are coming around. Oh, they still slaughtered me. Alright, cavalry. 
This is your finest hour. You gotta take out these archers or we're gonna get absolutely wrecked. Axes get behind these guys. Nice. So yeah, we definitely want to make sure we basically chase down everybody we can in this battle. Oh shit. Oh, they broke, they broke. Okay, cool, cool. Shoot them. Uh, I need to take all these guys off skirmish mode. back come back cool so that cavalry charge on the on our flank was actually uh, not insane where's my oh they're over here okay cool so we should actually ooh that unit's getting kind of wrecked get them to fire over there actually but yeah we definitely want to chase down as many as the, uh, oh, Jesus. we definitely want to chase down as many of them as we can I and realize that Similiang has uh, just ran off on his own alright interrupt their movement so they don't get a charge off. Nice, so we'll slaughter them eventually. Uh, yeah, they've broken through here. That's no bueno. Alright, we've ab absolutely slaughtered their archers though, that's good. Do they do something with Sword Cav, I wonder? Because, like, when I use them Earlier, earlier on in the uh, the game's life, they didn't do fuck all. Like charging them at like archers, they just killed nothing. So it seems like they've changed that because now we're just making mincemeat of them. Which all I can say is thank God. Far into these Dao infantry. Excellent. Flank them all here. Oh, we got our cav here. Let's charge into them. That looks so nice. Cool. Oh, some enemies came back for a split second. Alright, they've basically annihilated that unit. There's a full unit of 205 here that we'll just ignore with these guys. Send the sword cab after them. And that's basically it, it seems. Yep. Cool. Oh, a bunch of saber militia. I want to get rid of them. Definitely want that full unit to be killed. Before they get back to the city, quick! Run them down! It's like a full unit, Jesus. They were literally just running away the entire time, I think. Before they make it back. Rally! Our general needs our aid! Yeah, they're not really doing much, but that's. Ah, never mind, never mind, there we go. Alright, well, they're not dropping them, like, insanely fast. What I need is a charge bonus, but I'm not gonna get it.
Okay, that killed a couple. Yeah, they're just... They're too fast! <laughs> I can't properly run them down. There we go, that was a nice bunch of them. I just want to make the... Auto-resolve of the town easier, but... It's looking like that'll be hard to do. Yeah, they're just... Oh! Okay, I, f I fucked them over there. There we go, nice! That killed a bunch of them. Oh, beautiful, okay. Yeah, we got them. Yeah, this is kind of pointless, spending this long on it, but... Yeah, that's good enough. Close victory! I'll take it. I still have 2,400 men. They outnumbered me at one point. So, I'll definitely take that. Our worst casualties were in our, um... That one unit of spear guards that's down to 49. Our cavalry barely lost anyone, which is miraculous. And they got hundreds of kills. I think into the thousands. Yeah, into the thousands between them. And yeah, I'll take that re replenishment. Tops. So we basically lost no one. Shen Yu declared war on Bian Bing. Sima Wei declared war on Bai Jin. I declared war on Sima Wei. Buildings damage, that doesn't matter. I don't want that. I'm taking it. So it's still saying a close victory, so we're gonna lose 800. Jesus. There's barely anyone left, but oh well. We got some more armor. Oh, this. And then we killed Sima Shun. Well, that was their new name, but whatever the original guy's name was. Alright, so now... We are at our domain limit once again. So the plan is to probably take this and then give it to South Juan, maybe? Ah, this guy leveled up. Excellent. Get us that flaming shot for those trebuchets, please. And then I think... Oh, I don't have the money. Oh, I also have no food. Yes, because I took this city. That makes a lot of sense. That's a bit of a problem. I don't know why I didn't think of that. <laughs> oh my. Okay, so this place is actually making food. So maybe it won't be so bad. We're still going to be negative, but... We'll see. Yeah, no one wants cooperation because I've already vassalized the people that would probably do it. That's fine. End turn. So yeah, I'll probably take Nan Yang, Battle peace out, and then give it to them. The Military access from Shan Yu for a thousand? Sure. We are in concert this day. Why not? You have no reason to be up here, really, but sure. Sima Yue formed a coalition with Sima Wei. Oh boy. Oh, lots of coalitions being formed. Okay. So I could actually attack this in, in on this turn. Okay, cool. Let's do it. Decisive victory. Beautiful. Uh, we could even capture this guy, possibly. That would be cool. I think so. Uh, no, he died. Okay, never mind. He's not being captured. He is just straight up dead. Only by growth. The and then yeah, spread. I'll give that I'll give that to uh, this guy. If he will take it, I hope he will. Uh to see you. Ooh. Your heir, huh? Anyway, uh, trade territory and that that was Nanyang, correct. So I don't really want to take his money. Maybe I'll request food so I'm not negative. Yeah, there we go. Why not? Got any ancillaries? A bunch of armor that I gave you, I think. Let's just request a little bit of money. Which we are actually not sh too short on ourselves, which is nice. Cool. Goodwill stabilizes relations. Nice. So now our uh, domain won't go nuts. 
And I mean, I could also take the town and also give that to him. Just so that we're, uh... yeah, I think I will do that. And then we'll get peace with Sima Wei. Does he have, he still has two, okay. Oh, I think this guy's just dead though. Interesting. I cannot. So this is a Guan Yushan army. Or Guan Guan Yushan. Oh, is this her? Oh, it is. I wonder if they yes, have any yes, territory. Stop. I don't think they do. Oh, that's this lady. Jesus, I'm losing my mind. Never mind. Excuse me. There was another one that has no land, I think. Destroy anyway, I'm losing my mind. Don't mind me. Um, let's upgrade. It's. I really need to get an actual farmland for myself. I. It sucks that I did have to give this away. Is there any like around? No. I will have to look elsewhere for my food. We could go this way. Oh, there's farmland here. Owning owned by the Jin. Okay. Well, we'll have to see before we act on that. See, so yeah, let's take out... Oh! Oh! That was moronic. I didn't even think about the fact that they would be attacking me. Ah! Uh, I feel like there's no point because the vanguards will just absolutely destroy me, but... Who knows? Oh. Well, the, uh, the, yeah, the archers killed more than pretty much everything except for the cav. Wowee, that's fucking awful. Apologies to my language, but that's annoying as hell. Very annoying. Alright. A good year. So that makes... Every, I don't care about peasantry, so I'll accept for the money. Another branch grows and sprouts. Oh, I can't believe that piece of shit was able to just sneak in and take that. All because AI vanguards are ridiculously overpowered. And just run into combat and no worries. I mean, they were just militia, but like, Jesus Christ. It's not like these guys are legendary or like Lubu or something. They just absolutely slaughtered them without them being able to do anything back. That's stupid as fuck. Uh, Sima Liang leveled up. And what was it I was going to do? Uh, mm, I probably want this just for the armor. Yeah. Well, let's give him. Let's give away some of these. Jesus. I forgot I had like a million. Let's get his instinct up a little bit. Uh, you, is there anything that would put up your resolve? Nope. Or not resolve, that's not what I meant for him anyway. I meant instinct, but we'll put his resolve up, I guess. Just so he has a little bit of health. So that's actually making people quite unhappy. It's definitely not worth it for the 15%. That's... No. Well, then again, basically everything that makes you more money makes every, everybody upset. Okay. Ah. Uh. Oh, negative 22% for my industry. Okay. That's stupid. Oh, hello. That, that Seema Way is over here somewhere. Gotcha. And he's probably going after my city, so let's not let that happen, please. This guy's a legendary, even though he's just a random mug. Okay. Resist the chaos of change. Oh, you don't even like him, so yeah, I will get this new guy Deflect then. with shield 
cleave with sword. Rejoice. And they'll just act as an extra layer of defense on this place. Um. Upgrade that. That's basically all I can do. Uh, so yeah, let's end the turn. Let us talk trade. A coalition with Sima I. Mm, that coalition's pretty big. Uh, sure, why not? Let's see how it goes. I mean, I can leave at any time, so. But I would definitely rather take a coalition offer from one of the eight princes over just some random minor guy. So he's just gonna march further into the land. That's a big army. Cool, we got uh, that reform done. Still not a prince though, so I mean, doesn't really do much for us. Let's go for this next, I suppose. A gladdening sign. Shit, I shouldn't have force marched. I gotta wait even longer. Yeah, I should wait a turn. I cannot. Clarity shines the path to peace. Garrison here's not that big, so that would be a bad idea. I believe. Thought. Yeah, just just so I don't get caught with my pants down, I should wait. At least this place has a good garrison. That's not a bad building at all to upgrade. Let's get this one. And I don't have enough for that. Okay, fine. We'll hold off on upgrading anything. We offer peace for now. You want me to give you money for peace? No. This is an insult. Other than taking Zhang Yang, you guys have literally done nothing to me, so. Be cool if I Oh, I'm being besieged. That's not cool at all. Serve the people. Right, time to get revenge on these bastards. No mercy. So three units of archers, six units of infantry, albeit three of them aren't at full strength. Two units of cav. Hmm. Versus two units of cav. Five archers? <laughs> And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven units. Two strategists, so they don't really mean anything, but seem away is a bit annoying. I wonder if I could get peace with him. Well, not this one, but this one. Not you again. Oh, I can! Oh, well, beautiful. That's actually really good. Because I don't want to fuck around with this. Do I have any ancillaries I could trade away? That's pretty good armor. I don't want to just get get rid of that. Uh, I'll give you a clay rat and some water clock. Why not? And then... Oh. Yeah, the game is like, come on now. You're taking the piss. Don't offer that little... It is agreed. Cool. Yeah, frig off. Get away from my capital. Problem solved. Diplomacy does wonders. Yeah, I was gonna say, it would be cool if he just goes on the warpath and takes out Nan Yang for himself, but I don't think he will. So now Runan is all fucked up, so I have to spend the money on that. And yeah, next turn we'll be able to attack the Toolmaker. 
it's very interesting having to like not actually oh you coward you actual coward it's uh really interesting not being able to take just whatever you want in normal uh total war fashion it's kind of nice but also very strange request to join the war uh okay so they just went to war with no one i guess Remain supple. you absolutely li you little bitches i can't believe it take that back Justice cannot be denied. In time, they will thank us for this. Please excuse the fucking idiots outside with their loud ass exhausts. Alright, that gave us a little bit more money. We need to get this uh, industry income up for sure. It's only 450 to finish it. I could even put it up again. But I think I'll save the money and my noble support. <laughs> Um, I have no one to put in a, uh, administrator slot, but could I, what would putting one of you guys in here do? Plus one satisfaction faction wide, nine morale when defending, plus five percent income, and I would get one wealth alignment. Is that what you get from these guys? Yes. What would I get from him? Mind. Minus five corruption everywhere. That's actually not that bad. And a new trade agreement. He doesn't like my son, but I mean, fuck, I don't really care. Oh, he's really upset. But that would make him a little bit happier. Um, what is mine to give us again? Research rate. It's not bad. See, the more wealth we have the more money from all sources we get. So maybe I will put Sima Yang there. That'll make him happier. Yeah, everybody's just kind of meh at the moment. That's kind of sad. Uh, now, now what's this bitch gonna do? Who knows? I sure don't. So we have a few more people that might actually uh, cooperate. Greetings. I could get this guy by giving away basically all of my money, but no land. It would just be uh, my good ancillaries. Welcome. Take a seat. This guy's even less. Hmm. So instead of this, let's say I could marry someone away. No, that guy's insane. Never mind. We don't want to get rid of him. See, I don't quite want to trade away everything, but it would be nice to have a, even another. We are listening. Yeah, whatever. That's fine. Uh, let's end another turn. The fact that we have two is already, like, way more than I thought. Sima Chi. He's over there. I mean, if you want him, uh, he's kind of small. But, sure, I guess. As you wish. Oh. Oh, the... No, oh, that doesn't matter, then. The other we guy. The guy... No threat to you didn't want to himself. Uh, no, I'm not giving you all that shit. We expected gratitude. Moron. Zhang Kua. Yeah, she's just gonna run away. Ugh. Uh, Zhu Yan is now at war with me. That's fine. Oh, I can actually catch her. Sweet. Uh, yeah, I don't even want to waste my time with you. And they're all dead, thankfully. Apparently I lost a duel to one of those morons. Yeah, I bet. I bet that definitely would have happened in the uh, real battle if we played it. Totally. Um, let's take that money, that's a lot of money. And we killed their leader. She deserved it. Alright, what do we want to give to you? Probably this, so that we can... That just puts up his damage, though. Um... Uh, 
We don't really care about that, other than the fact that it would give him more expertise, but this would as well. Let's go for this, then, just so he has it. And we could actually lose... We could take the hit on three to have at least a little bit of damage, or extra damage, rather. Alright, it would be really nice if we could get here and give it to him, and then just peace out, maybe. How bad does... do they want peace, anyway? Probably not, like, crazy. No, it's not even a yes now, get because he dragged that other guy in. Okay. Ooh, Sean Yu. Greetings. I would have to give him territory, though. And basically everything else. So no, we won't do that. Let's see. I don't really want to bother with this because like, because I want to upgrade my cities, but I have no food. So that's a bit of a problem. I could upgrade the tool maker to get us some more money. I might as well. Let's end the turn. A marriage do, do, do. strong relations. You want to pay me to take this lady as my wife. They don't like each other, so... I mean, I might do it just for the money. I mean, there's... She'll cost us money, though, to have. And I don't know anything about her, just that she's level 3 and a manipulator. So she'd be... she'd be a good spy. Yeah, screw it. Let's take her. That'll make him like me more. And he's just like, here, please take this lady and all this money. Please. We don't want her. Alright, some more people are going to war. Yep. Yep. The question of rank. So I just got this lady. I could piss her off. Or I can make her happier. Get 20% corruption in Zhang Yang, which is not making us very much money. So I could make her happier, get 5 wealth alignment. That wouldn't put me at the next level anyway. So let's, uh, let's get some corruption, I guess. That's only for 5 turns. So we'll live. Alright, let's go marching up north. I mean, realistically, if my economy does tank, I can get rid of this guy. Or this or this army, I guess. I just don't really want to, do I? We'll upgrade that. And what else can we do? Anything new? We could get some non-aggression. Welcome. Take a seat. He's actually not that far off. I'm well, eager I can't. To listen. I can't offer him uh, non-aggression. Oh, oh! I can give him non-aggression and cooperation. Oh, so it's even easier now. Oh my god. Yeah, let's let's give him some stuff. Um, that brings us to nine point four. See, I don't really. Kn well, where is he? Where is Mao Ren anyway? I can't even see him. Where is he? I don't really want a vassal that I can't see. Oh! Wait, is this the guy that... No, that was a different guy, I think. I don't know if he has any territory or not. I wish it would tell me. Oh! One commander. Never mind, it does tell you that. <laughs> okay, so he is actually alive somewhere. But is it... Am I able to get it with other people, too? Yeah, this is the guy. Okay, Sima Mao is the guy that has no territory. Right? Yeah, okay. So yeah, I could... Oh, break, break the system. Non-aggression pact and then the vassalize. So it's even cheaper. So I can get this guy. This 
Because, yeah, like, having another one wouldn't be too bad. That would make us more money. Oh, okay. That's a lot, but... You know what? I will offer this guy his autonomy. Jesus. Okay, so I don't need to give him nearly as much. Realistically, I could give it to any of these people, but the, getting it without it would be really nice because, I mean, eventually I could just annex them, I suppose. Um, give me some money, I guess. Become my vassal and... Well, actually, no, I shouldn't do that so that he actually likes me. I'll give him a... I'll, I'll ask for a little bit. A little bit more. We'll just get a couple hundred. Because I do want some positive points so that he doesn't just straight up hate me. Uh, mediate that peace, please. Mediate that peace, please. Do not fight my vassal. Oh god, everybody's at war with this dude. Alright, there we go. Nice! I still can't even tell where that guy is. You'd think that after I vassalize him, he would just show up. Oh, is, it, is he over here? Who knows? Well, we'll find him someday, I suppose. We still have a little bit of a wait for this. There's no point to force march. Cool, so we have three now. And we're on our way to moderate, so we'll double our uh, amount of holdings again, and we can actually start expanding a little bit. It's nice! It's nice to actually finally play as a faction that Take needs to vassalize. Uh, Sean Yu, sure. A pleasing foundation to build upon. It's really nice, a uh, nice change of pace. It's not always the answer. Uh, Song Wei. Uh, sure, I mean, we're friends. We are in concert this day. As I was saying, it's very nice to play as someone who needs vassals. Um, it's a big difference, because I usually just conquer everything, so... This is very fun. And different. So I'm excited. Uh, continue marching to Nanyang, and we'll just give that to, uh... Cao Huan. We got another reform, and we're still not a prince, but we're close. We're only seven prestige away. Okay. The last few levels give extra prestige there. Same with that. Okay. Uh, none of these just give you free prestige, do they? No. Okay. We could make our characters cheaper. I don't know how much they're costing us, but it's probably a lot. 50? Okay, no, that's not very much. Oh, actually, I can check that from my economy. Never mind. Salary is only 650, so we'll, we'll take 130 off. That's fine. And the turn. And then, yeah, we'll take this, give it to our vassal. For a price, maybe. Uh, who's he gone to war with? <laughs> they kind of just say he joined a war and then it doesn't say who he went to war with. Sprout ever upwards to heaven. All right, a decisive victory, huh? What kind of map is this? Um, I can't remember what battle it was. I guess it was this episode that we fought that really shitty defense, and that might have been the only battle, so let's do something where we don't get absolutely slaughtered, shall we? Here we begin. Let us fight to the end. Let's fight we to the end. We the precipice. Time to fight. 
Alright. Oh, we have no... Flaming arrows. That's a bit of a problem. But we have flaming shot, I believe. For our one trebuchet. Who is, like, level 3 at most. Level 5! Never mind. Oh, we might actually be able to break in no problem then. Oh, shit. And this settlement's actually, like, really easy to attack. Well, well, well. I'll take this. An easy assault. I like it. I very much enjoy the sound of that. Well, I mean, I guess I knew it was going to be easy anyway, but... Are they just going to come out to me? They are! Alright! That makes this super easy. Uh, no. But I will put you in a duel, sure. Oh, that damage! I like this purple. Very nice. That is brutal, just seeing the arrows and bolts come into, into focus. Very scary. Uh, no, I'm gonna have to uh, decline that. Thank you very much. Stand ready. The enemy warriors are running. Ha! Let's fly. Ooh, some stuttering for some reason. Release missiles. Fire upon them. Rain down death. Ten. Prepare. Destroy them. Get away from my crossbows, you bastard! Yeah. Uh, oh, nice. No, I'll decline again. Thank you. Shut up and die! Ah, <laughs> he actually did. Okay. Oh my, the English. I really need to switch to Chinese, but apparently some of the things in this uh, early build of the DLC, some of the things, uh, the translation is broken or something, and I'd rather know what... Well, I mean, when it comes to the battle chatter, I don't really care what they're saying, because it's still going to be the same stuff, the just in Chinese. But, what I do kind of want to... I definitely would rather uh, the Chinese voice acting, but, yeah. Haxo was letting me... No, not Haxo. Um, was it Smart Donkey? I think maybe Smart Donkey mentioned it. To me, that is. Not in any video, because of course, this is recorded way in advance of when this will be released. But yeah. So yeah, they're just very slowly, one by one, coming out to their dooms. We killed that dude. And now let's kill him in actual combat. Where he will die quite quickly, I believe. And then we've essentially won. I think this is the last unit. Yep. Cool. So we didn't even need to step a single foot. Oh, whoops. We're losing troops by standing there. So let's just end this. Um, we didn't even have to step foot within the city. And we did not lose very many men. Beautiful. Oh, the crossbow's doing work. Well, one of the, I was going to say they all did over 200, but the one of them the didn't. Oh, we lost 156 men. That is nothing. Oh, looting actually puts down our jurisdiction. Let's not do that. I didn't realize that. Whoopsies. Oh, that made me a prince. Wow. Okay. I'm pretty sure I can't own that. Oh, well, I will be able to very soon. China is people. Oh, a chain mine would be useful. I kind of don't need this though, so let's uh yeah, we'll we'll do what we said and we'll give it to him. A joy to see you. Uh what is I always forget. Nan Yang. Yes, the our contested one, that would make sense. I could just do that and make him very happy. 
could also take some armor or something. Yeah, I'll, I'll just give it to you, so that makes you very happy. foundations are built on such small gestures. A welcome sight. Still not going up, though. Hmm. Hopefully this is worth it. Cool, this guy leveled up again, so let's get some range damage. And, I mean, I guess technically I don't, I don't have to actually get peace with Sima away now. Sima, Sima, I'm saying it interchangeably, sorry. Um, I could actually go after him and expand uh, this way to take a few more territories. I might actually do that. There's no real reason to not go to war with them now, or not stay at war. Actually, the biggest target would probably be to take Luo Yang trade port. Let's work on that. We'll move this way. And uh, Sima Liang will get you marching over here to the west. Wonderful. Uh, we have a, d a few different things we could w upgrade at uh, Zhang Yang. Lots and lots of money. In the turn. I'm pretty sure we're close to the end of this episode. Yes, only a few more minutes. Our goals are in harmony. Uh, they... You're not my ally. Uh, well, you. I guess you are my ally, technically. You want me to go to war with Bian Bing? Oh, here's Mia Mao Ren. He owns two territories. Nice. Hopefully Sima Ai doesn't want to go to war with him. That would suck. Um, just for the money, yeah, sure, I'll go to war with him. He, all he owns is his level to one town. <laughs> yeah, I'll whore myself out uh, in conflicts for money, sure. that I joined his war. We got a mission for taking the Imperial City. Uh, that'll, that might have to wait, you know, since I don't really want to go, go to war with the Jin since I can't even own that much land. That'll be an end goal for us. We might even um, become... We might do a Regent game. I haven't even decided what I want to do. I guess it kind of depends on how it goes. Like, if we get offered the Regency, I mean, I'll definitely take it. Why the hell not? Anybody else want to cooperate? Welcome, friend. And it's all my money. <laughs> um, but it would be another vassal already. I think I'm good with what I have because we're already like really big for what I'm dealing with. So we'll uh, we'll just focus on some other things. So am I moderate yet? No. Very soon though. It's going up by seven. So maybe like three more turns and we'll be moderate? I have no idea. I can't tell what number it is. On the march. I could upgrade this for an extra food so that we're not on zero. Let's do that. Did I put a person as my advisor yet? I think I did. Oh, here's Sima Wei himself. Sima, whatever. Oh. You have a proposal. Interesting. Okay. So the Empire controls the Emperor <laughs> until you take it. Oh, so if I take Liu Yang, he could reject, and he would go to someone else. Interesting. Ooh. Remain Not possible. Oh my god, look at all these heavy spearmen. Good thing I have uh, crossbows. Through wisdom. Oh, I'm not in my own territory, so I can't switch these units. All right, well, guys, we ever upwards to are going to start the next episode with this. We have the exact same amount of men, but he has better troops. Ooh.
Oh, they also have their own trebuchets. Oy, that's kind of scary. But they only have two cav units. And four range units plus... Okay, so five overall because of the catapults or the trebuchets as well. Apparently we have superior forces. I'm just thinking before I end this, should I actually play it? Because <laughs> I don't want to leave you guys on a cliffhanger and then next episode just not do it. Uh, it's just that their infantry is very scary. They do a lot of uh, armor damage. But the thing is, is, I have so many missiles that like a lot of them will just get slaughtered. Can ex excuse the car out on the road. Oh, these are just super heavy, uh, heavily armored swords. Okay, so none of these actually have shields. So even our... Well, the normal archers won't do, like... Oh, they still do 22 damage. Piercing, like, that's still pretty good. So yes, we will uh, save it, and we'll, we'll start the next episode with this fight. Thank you guys for watching. If you're enjoying, please just leave a like and a comment down below, as always. And if you enjoyed the series, make sure you subscribe, because there's going to be plenty more coming in the uh, next few days. Uh, until next time, this has been Overkill, and I am signing out. Goodbye.